Yeah, you still like energy, right? Mm -hmm. as, as one of, if not your, your top idea, because you know the, the narrative on that was super strong and it's only a matter of time before it cracks and then it cracked, why is it gonna recover? I think any sort of pullback you're seeing right now is just an opportunity to buy. And I think ultimately, when you look at your energy companies, oil prices have come down, but there's still such a supply and demand issue. So many rigs were shut down back in 2020 and just with ESG now becoming the focus. And there's so much demand that's not going away. And energy prices do not need to be as high as they are now because their break-evens are significantly lower. So I think that can actually still lead to good um, some good big, momentum going forward. Sorry to, sorry to step on your toes there. Some big names you like, Exxon, Chevron, and uh, you're in the Buffett uh, oxy trade. Yeah, I mean, if Buffett likes it, yeah, you got it. Yeah. <laughs> you Although get it got downgraded that. today, I mean, it's you know, it's gone up so much because in you know, in, at least in some respects of of the Buffett uh, halo. Yeah, and I mean, ultimately though, I think you want to look at these companies that have really strong balance sheets. And they back in 2020 when oil prices were so low, they had to get so much more efficient. And I think that's just putting them in such a better position right now. Okay, let's expand.